Well, here's a little tour of the barn. I've always struggled to get light in here. Everything is just brown and wood, and it just sucks the light out of the air. So I've got, I don't know if you can really tell what's going on in here. There's one of my 400 watt high bay fixtures that has died and another one died the other day. So it's time to make a change in here. That one's still working. It's the only one left. In the ceiling fans, I've got 100 watt equivalent LED bulbs, three of them. So I've got a total of nine of them here in the barn. Again, a lot of natural light, which helps a lot. But uh, it's very hard working on vehicles in here without these high bay fixtures. And uh, the last one that went it actually took the circuit with it. And I had to get it out of the circuit to make the other ones work. So it was time for a change. So uh, Howard, one of my coworkers, works in our renewables group and LED lighting replacements. And I asked him to find me a solution for my barn in a high bay led so anyway this is what he came up with for me these are 150 watt there are 5000 kelvin so it's a very white light um, and an led high bay and i have just put two of them up and uh wow look at that they're just going to be obnoxious if you look at them you'll just see spots they are a uh, 22 thousand fifty lumens of light output and uh these are going to be so nice guys scooby looks great under the lights doesn't she all right uh anyway i got those up got two of them up a um, little more difficult to move these rigs to get the other two but i'll endeavor to do that here in the next week or two uh just thought i'd show you just a little bit led high bay light and they are right on bright no more issues working on cars uh under these lights very bright very 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 nice scooby you're looking good bud okay that's it